this is hilarious okay this is pretty funny this is the list of disinformation campaigns according to msnbc so the corporate media has come through and told you who they don't wait right ados american descendants of slaves blexit tangibles fba hashtag fba foundational black americans black voices for trump walk away Let's go down this list. Walk away is that striker guys thing, and it's just a, a ploy to get more people uh, towards you know the uh, the Republican side. I don't particularly consider a walk away a um like that's definitely not a black thing. Black voices for Trump. Um, I, that's the one I have the least knowledge of their leadership or you know what runs them. So yeah, I don't consider like like I, like as far as I'm concerned, yeah, it may as well just be a uh, black voice for Trump. Uh the FBA, that's Tariq Nasheed's thing. Foundational Black Americans. That is a uh, Tariq Nasheed's thing. They, they dang, they didn't even bring up in Cobra. <laughs> Blexit is uh that Candace Owens nonsense that, you know, Kanye was like, "Wait, I, mean, I ain't a part of this. Let me let me bounce." And then you got Ados, which is uh Tone Antonio Moore and Yvette Carnell's um, outfit, American Descendants of Slaves, and it's a list of disinformation, they, they all fall on the list of disinformation campaigns, oh my goodness, Mass, Mass ain't what y'all, I'm just saying, and this is the list of t issues targeting black voters, this is what, so this is what the Democratic uh, Party wants for, you know, wants the Negroes to, to, to be up on, reparations, really, 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 oh my goodness, just going to drag that into the ground, huh? Criminal justice. I actually have a degree in criminal justice, and that's why I'm sitting here talking about like ending the drug, ending the drug war, um, and not just criminal justice, including family courts up in there too. You know, let's start incentivizing our families to stay together to do the whole nuclear thing. Uh, climate change. Yeah, uh, really. Have you seen urban America? Have you been through these streets, bruh? And immigration, yeah, because, you know, they took their jobs. Not particularly, but, like, they do the jobs cheaper. Oh. <laughs> so this is, uh, this is basically, I mean, corporate media, the corporations, those who really run the country, are telling you what the Negroes think right here. All right? Um, and whereas I personally do not really deal with any of these groups uh because they just like it's not i feel like i'm best off speaking for myself um but at the same time you know i mean i'm, I'm familiar with all of them and uh seriously like yo like uh i don't even know why msnbc would do this because all you're doing is raising their profile with the 15 or so folks that you do that you do got you know what I'm saying or the i, be, I guess the donors the, the, the Caucasian donors that really want to help the Negroes, I guess. I don't know. But you put, like, straight-up names on there or as, as one side. And on the other side, it's just pure issues that ultimately, as far as this man of color is concerned, don't really help outside of the criminal justice one. But guess what? Like, the, a return of industry to these communities, a return of, you know, saying a, a rebalancing of the family courts, these are the things that would really help the, the uh, like you know black america for the most part or, or really all of america that's my thing like all of sorry 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 but yeah all of america not just the black people but everybody because this is bullshit it really is and it's just it's just the corporate overlords telling you who and who to wait and who not to so, with that being said, we're going to bring this one to an end because, really, beyond that, I have nothing else to say about any of these groups. I don't, I have no affiliation with any of these groups. I blex it. I mean, like I said, it's Candace Owens thing. Enjoy. Have fun. It's Nah, I'm good. Tariq Nasheed. No, bro. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Ados is just so dead set on that whole reparations thing that, like, I mean, Ados is the main one that's pushing for that reparations thing. I don't know why they're not um you know saying like truly attributing that to them um i've seen black i've seen posts from black voices for trump that i actually like and as far as walkway goes i did a whole video on that on the official elected official channel so you know if you want to hear my thoughts on that then no because i'm a democrat i'm, I'm, not, I'm I, guys i got like a probably like a few months left on this whole thing so yeah <laughs> and then i get to i get to go back to free agency 
But yeah, with that being said, man, we're gonna bring this one to an end. All the internet stuff. If you like the toss, if you like this, like, go ahead, do that too. Nobody's scared of you. Sub if you enjoy my fantastic voice. See, you wanna give videos like this every single day? Share because sharing is caring. And YouTube and bitch shooting like I just got finished with a week suspension because they think I'm a hate monger. Oh man. <laughs> And speak. Let me know. Uh, bang the bell. Bang the bell for notifications. And speak. Let me know. What do you think in the comments? I mean, are, are you familiar with any of these groups? Do you, you know, you recommend them? Do you don't recommend them? What are your thoughts on EOS? What are your thoughts on Blexit? What are your thoughts on Tangibles uh, or Tariq Nasheed? Um, Black Voices for Trump. Walk away. Or your or what are your thoughts on reparations, criminal justice, climate change, immigration? I don't care. But my, my comment section's always open. And until the next one.